Sergeant First Class Rich Robertson can't feel anything from his chest down. Uh, excuse me. Three years ago, he was injured by a mine in the Iraqi desert. Yeah, I've lost a lot, um, but a lot of other people lost a whole lot more uh, in Iraq and Afghanistan. Um, you know, I figure I gave about 80%. Uh, those guys have given 100%, so it's, uh, my sacrifice is very small. That kind of positive outlook earned him a spot as a mentor for Vet Connect, an Enable America program that gives wounded warriors, like himself, a push in the right direction. Each person's going to have their own path to travel. I just I want to kind of show them, hey, you know, this is, uh, this is the way I did it. I don't, uh, and I don't claim to know what they're going through. Each person handles their own injury differently. Robertson was asked to travel from the Carolinas to speak at Mosey today for Disabled Awareness Day. The expo opens eyes to the latest technology <laughs> and to people like Robertson, who says he still does as much as he used to, like hunting with his buddies. It just takes him more time. I think everything through twice, three times, and work out. Uh, four or five different courses of action. Well, what if I fall out of my chair reaching for this? Or, uh, you know, uh, something as simple as uh, traveling. You know, I have to uh, think, rethink, and, uh, and plan. Robertson's injuries didn't shy him away from the military. He's still on active duty at Fort Bragg, where he coordinates training. In Tampa, I'm Katherine Simmons, Bay News 9.